Yeah. If you were, if if um if you willing to become a fucking beast, then then that just means you you willing to become fucking immortalized. You ain't going to be no fucking immortal. You ain't going to be your name ain't going to be mentioned amongst the highest of ranks if you scared to be a fucking man, if you scared to be a real being. Yo, your name ain't gonna be fucking mentioned amongst the gods if you scared. If you scared, if you a little bitch, your name ain't about to be mentioned. Nobody about to, nobody talking about the little, the little bitch. Nobody talking about them. The, if your name gonna be mentioned amongst the gods, you gotta be willing to do godly shit, period, period. You run around doing mediocre ass normal people shit expecting to be immortalized. Get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here. There ain't nothing here for you, buddy. I, I I see you. I see you, Bryce. Hola, niño. Hola, señor. Hola, señor cacho cucho. Cucho. En la vez con la sala dosa la vasa. Ese homes. I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck. You, you, people run around copying the next motherfucker. Don't know how to cultivate no type of individuality. No type of individuality. No type of personal development. They just run around sharing memes, copying what the next basic motherfucker doing. How about you cultivate your own goddamn thoughts for once, you son of a bitch? Yeah. Yeah, you son of a bitch. I don't give a fuck. You're going to get your ass up and you're going to make a difference. You're going to make a motherfucking difference in this goddamn world. You understand me? That's on Big Cat, nigga. That's on Big Cat. Niggas just, if you a follower, I really can't fuck with you. I got very little respect for you. I got very, I can't follow what's behind me. I can't, I can't respect what's behind me. Especially being a leader ass nigga, a big dick, big cat ass nigga. I ain't looking behind me, so how the fuck I'ma even see you? How the fuck I I'ma even see you? I'm looking straight ahead. I promise you, I ain't in no competition with no mere mortal ass peon ass nigga. What the fuck? What the fuck do I even look like paying attention to that shit? We do big cat, we do big cat shit. On a regular fucking basis, we don't, we don't give a fuck about what no bitch or no nigga has to say about us, period. And we keep that motherfucking shit pushing. And we keep that motherfucking shit player. Motherfucker, motherfuckers get done dirt. They get, they, something happens to them and they just want to play the victim. Lay down on their dick for the rest of their life. Don't ever want to get back up. I promise you it ain't gonna be me. I promise you it ain't gonna be me. Hey, shout out to all the shout out to all the bitch ass niggas, bitch ass hoes that thought they was gonna leave me for dead and I got right the fuck back up and I slapped them in their motherfucking mouth with that big cat shit. Shout out to y'all bitch ass niggas, cause I promise you I ain't dead, nigga. I ain't dead. I'm still alive, nigga. I'm right here, nigga. It's all me. All 2021. I can promise you that. I can promise you that much. Get the fuck up. Ain't nobody feeling sorry for you. Ain't nobody feeling sorry for you. Ain't nobody showing you no fucking pity. What you do with your energy is solely based on the thoughts you think about yourself. If you think you're the shit, you're gonna create a you're gonna create a reality that reflects that externally. If you think you ain't shit, your reality is gonna reflect that. Everybody you attract in your life is going to be ain't shit individuals, period, period. But if you walk around knowing you the shit, everybody you attract going to be fucking champions and winners. I only fuck with champions and winners. And let me tell you, there's very few of them. There's very few of them. Most people like to be the victim. That ain't no championship mentality. That ain't no championship thought process. I'm the victim. Fuck no. If a motherfucker stab me in my back, I'm ripping that knife out and I'm going to slice their throat with that shit. 
I'm a, I'm a, I'm a heal my motherfucking wound up ten times stronger, fortify it ten times stronger than it was before. You got me fucked up thinking I'm finna lay down and oh woe is me, woe is me. I, who, who the fuck, who the fuck think, you, who do you think raised me some pussies? Who do you? I was raised in a motherfucking lion's den, nigga. Big cat energy only. We had to we had to eat to survive. If you if you wanted to survive, you had to fight, nigga. Mo I can most most individuals on that soft bullshit. Can you please can you please censor yourself and wa wa watch how you speak? Shut the fuck up. Get the fuck out. Telly Tubby's, Telly Tubby, uh, 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 go, go Powerpuff game time is for, uh, that ain't, that ain't me. That ain't on, that ain't the shit that Big Cat is on. We on some get, get real, get tough, or get the fuck on. You gonna get trampled your motherfucking ass over real quick, real quick. In order to really embody that Big Cat spirit, you gotta know how to hunt. Cause you, I can promise you, you being hunted. That's why most of these pussy ass niggas they get hurt by a little old female, and they wanna oh my heart broke and let me just cry and get drunk and throw my life away. You, you you got hunted and your motherfucking ass got ate. But when you the hunter, when you the predator, the apex predator in this bitch, ain't nobody finna make you no fucking meal. Ain't nobody finna eat you. You eat every and any motherfucking thing that come out across your plate, nigga. Little niggas, little niggas don't understand that shit. They can't fathom that type of that type of ideology. Cause they too busy playing the victim. Oh, oh, this and that. I got a baby. Oh, oh nobody like me. Get the fuck out of here with that weak ass bullshit. That is some weak ass ass fuck nigga shit females too they get hurt and they just want to oh let me just uh, i don't know you either the motherfucking victim or the victimizer period i promise you anybody who thought they were gonna make me a victim turned around and ended up getting slapped and they fucking grill with that big cat shit and they had to turn around and eat every single bit of that we ain't playing no little kid games. Little kids may play the victim. I was never on that bullshit, to be honest. So if we're going to keep it 1,000, it's either in you or it's not. Motherfuckers want to be censored, want to walk on eggshells. Oh, let me let me just, uh, 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 you know, uh, articulate it real nice for Karen. Fuck Karen and fuck you. I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck what they think. They wasn't with me shooting in the motherfucking gym, nigga. They couldn't even hold my nuts with two hands. They couldn't hold my nuts with two hands in a crane tractor. Get the fuck out of here. Motherfuckers couldn't hold my jock strap trying to tell me, can you, can you tone it down? You can get the fuck out of here. You can get the fuck on. Instantly, instantaneously. I, I, I don't want to fucks with you. I don't want to fucks with you. And I, a real nigga's going to pick and choose who he wants to fuck with. Some friendly ass, weak ass bitch going, oh, oh, you're my friend. You're my friend. You're my, get the fuck out of here. Not everybody's your friend. Some motherfuckers is meant to sit they ass, sit they funky ass in the bleachers and sit there and watch you ball the fuck out. Not everybody's no motherfucking hitter like that. Not everybody's no motherfucking shooter like that. You trying to make everybody your damn friend. When you put them in, when it's game time, who, where they at though? When it's game time, where the fuck them people you, 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 you place all your motherfucking, uh, uh, your trust in, your, your faith in. I got confidence in this motherfucker. He ain't never shot a motherfucking shot a day in his life, but that's your homie though. That's your shooter though. That's your day one, main one. Get the fuck out of here with that weak ass, following ass bullshit. Everybody want to be a motherfucking follower these days. It's it's pitiful. I'm going to tell you like this. Being a follower is a mental disorder. It's a bitch nigga disorder. I'm sorry, but I'm not sorry at all. Because motherfuckers want to pick up the motherfucking Facebook and flock together. Motherfuckers do meth together just because one motherfucker do meth. I'm going to do meth so uh, 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 they don't think I'm a loser. What kind of mentality is that? What kind of loser-ass mentality is these niggas really on out here? 
You gonna throw your life away because a whole group of people throwing their life away. You gonna jump off a cliff because a whole group of dumbass individuals, a dumbass collective is gonna jump off a motherfucking cliff. Get the fuck out of here. You gonna learn how to be your own individual. You gonna learn how to be your own individual. You gonna keep suffering them karmic cycles of toxicity and self hatred, self sabotage, stagnicity, stagnancy, whatever the fuck you wanna call it. Or you gonna evolve, learn to walk the fuck alone, learn to hold your own nuts up. Cause I, like I just said, why the fuck would I put faith in motherfuckers I know who can't hold my dick with two hands? You can't hold my dick with two hands. So why the fuck am I putting my faith in you? What the fuck? Get the fuck out of here. When it's when it's time to go, who the fuck's going with you? With no questions asked. It could be the littlest motherfucker, and they got more heart than most of these niggas. I seen the littlest, the littlest motherfuckers have more heart than most of these these niggas who claim they really doing some shit. They motherfuckers who claim they hard only when they in a group. That's the only time you see them wolfing. Is when they in a group of people. That's the only time you see them talking big or talking tough. Oh, I got this and I got. How the fuck do you stand when you solo, nigga? I don't hear all that woofing when you alone. I don't hear none of that shit when you, when you by yourself. But as soon as you get in a group, your following ass want to start woofing, want to start talking loud, getting tough. Get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here. You don't control no situation. The situation control, controls your ass. I can see I can see a group of motherfuckers just controlling your ass. You a puppet to them niggas. You a puppet to them niggas. You a puppet to them hoes. Them hoes say jump, you say how high, nigga. Them hoes say wash my clothes, you say on what motherfucking setting do you want it on, ma'am? You ain't no motherfucking king. You a motherfucking peasant. You a follower. You a follower. It's it's a it's a clear dichotomy. It's a clear dichotomy. The we the weed from the chaff. Either you about your shit or you just following what the fuck the next person doing and got to say. That's the only difference between what what's really the fuck going on in this world. Either you about your shit or you following what the next motherfucker got to say. And if they ain't on their shit, you ain't on your shit. I promise you, my energy is not determined by the energy of somebody else's. I create my own energy every single motherfucking day. That's what a big cat, big dick ass nigga do. He create his own energy, not depending on no motherfucker. He don't give a fuck. If you really on that energy, you're going to walk out into Give a fuck. You got guidance in the spiritual realm and you worried about what the fuck the next motherfucker got to say? Yeah, nah, you ain't on it. That ain't it, buddy. That ain't it, buddy, pal. That ain't it, guy. Get the fuck up on your shit. There's no excuse why you should be following a motherfucker off a cliff. There's no excuse to it. Other than you a codependent. Lack self-identity. Lack self-knowing. Lack self-cultivation. You don't know shit about yourself, but you trying to figure out the next motherfucker. Your life is in shambles, but you trying to blame the government for you not being on your shit? Get the fuck out of here. We're not doing that in 2021. It's time to be accountable. If your life ain't shit, you you don't need to do nothing else. Look at nobody else, but take your motherfucking ass to that mirror and point all 10 motherfucking fingers at yourself and realize that you ain't shit. If your life ain't shit, if you wake up every day thinking I ain't shit, my life ain't shit, you ain't shit, period. That can change. But like I said, that's, on, that's only you, something you can change, period. That's only something you can change. If you feel like you ain't shit, the people are, the, around you ain't shit, your circumstances ain't shit, I promise you, you ain't shit. It's a byproduct. It's a natural occurring cycle. It's a natural occurring situation and scenario. It's natural. That's natural. If you think everything around you ain't shit, your life ain't shit, you sad, you depressed, you ain't shit. I'm sorry, but I'm not sorry at motherfucking all. I'm not sorry. You get on that big cat shooter, you get the fuck out. You get the fuck out. It's it's the laws of the na- it's the law of nature. Since since this world's been going, since this world's been going, you think you think even the most heroic of individuals, people who saved other people, you think they was just waiting? You think they was giving a fuck what somebody had to say? No, they took action, period. No matter how rough, tenacious, 
no matter how disgusting it got. If you ain't willing to go through them trenches, you, you don't deserve no type of victory or success. Motherfuckers scared to go through the trenches so they so they flock to a group of motherfuckers who ain't shit, toxic individuals, motherfuckers who don't give a fuck about you. You'd rather you'd rather be with somebody who's gonna stab you in your back to, than to sit alone and really cultivate a deep inner knowing of yourself. That's disgusting. That's disgusting. You're gonna keep living a disgusting reality. You gonna keep living it. You see what the big dick, big cat sitting here doing? I'm living my motherfucking life, nigga. I'm living it the fuck up, nigga. I ain't worried about a goddamn thing. And I can put that on big cat now. Oh, shit, nigga. You, you got me fucked up if you think I'm worried about a bitch or a nigga. I'm worried about my motherfucking self and my motherfucking cat. Cause we on that big cat shit. Motherfuckers got it all fucked up. Uh, 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 my baby girl left me. Take your motherfucking ass to the gym, nigga. Oh, my, my, my daddy, my mama did me wrong. Take your motherfucking ass to the gym, nigga. You feeling sorry for yourself going to the bar, doing meth? Get your meth head ass out of here. There ain't no room for you. There ain't no room for you. I promise you. In, in, in the herd, in the herd, the, the slowest, uh, 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 weakest motherfucker, they get eaten. That's how that's how the law of the of the jungle, the wild law goes. That's how it goes. That's how it goes. It's always been that way. The strong survive. The strong survive. You're on some weak, submissive shit. You're not gonna survive long. You're gonna keep getting hurt. You're gonna keep getting broken. You're gonna keep being a bitch to somebody else. That's just the law of nature. If you dominate, you gonna dominate. If you submissive, get the fuck out of the way. As long as you don't bring that hate my way. As long as you don't bring that, uh, 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 you know what I'm saying, that, that hidden hate. Motherfuckers love to sit on the sidelines and watch you with that bullshit. Either they want to fuck you or, 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 or they want your spot. But what are they willing to do to even get close to taking your spot? Not a goddamn thing. Don't worry about them. They just birds. They just bird bitches, bird niggas. And I, I can bet that on motherfucking big cat. If you don't listen to shit I say, I, I'm going to let you know like this. I live a, a big majority of my life being submissive. I, I, I was just trying to be nice. You know what I'm saying? I, I, I shifted. You know what I'm saying? Let me, let me be nice. Let me be nice. I got stepped. I got stepped all motherfucking over. Got stab wounds. Got boot marks on my ass. Got motherfuckers shitting on me, pissing on me. It wasn't until Big Cat stood up, decided to let his dick and balls hang. That's when motherfuckers started respecting the Big Cat, putting a little bit of respect on that nigga name. You know what I'm saying? They ain't crossing my boundaries no more. I ain't, I ain't giving them the chance, stupid. I ain't giving them the motherfucking chance. Big Cat living luxurious. Big Cat on that high dimension shit. He, he on that high level, high dimension shit. Loving it all. Absorbing the motherfucking sunlight. Absorbing the motherfucking moonlight. Being grateful. Giving thanks to the most high God. Because that's all the motherfucking person you need. That's all the support you need is the divinity around you. Humans that come into your life, that's just an extra. If they're on some benevolent shit, that's, a, that's a, on some extra shit. That's an extra general sergeant. You just moved up ranks. If you get a strong, you lucky to, I'm telling you, the virtue of having a strong, uh, mindful, aware individual in your life, you can't find too many of them. Like I said, too, too many motherfuckers want to be in the back, want to be the caboose. They, too many motherfuckers scared to lead. As soon as you put them on that podium, they start shaking in the knees. They get weak in the motherfucking ankles. They can't say shit. They can't move. They get motherfucking paralyzed. Too many motherfuckers like that. If you get a strong motherfucker in your life, I promise you, you're going to learn how to appreciate and value that motherfucker. Because it's very little of us out here. It's very little of us who's willing to stand on our own ten toes and stand on what the fuck we believe in. A lot of motherfuckers is following. They see a group of motherfuckers flocking to one dude, they going to flock to him all together. It don't matter if that's the weakest motherfucker in the room. They just following what the next motherfucker is doing. So if you one of them motherfuckers, get your ass to the side. Move your motherfucking ass to the side. There ain't no room for you in the big cat jungle. There ain't no room for you in the big cat den at all. 
We don't want no weak ass individuals. That shit disgust me. Uh, uh, corona, nigga. Yeah. Uh, uh, COVID, nigga. I'm not fucking with it. So you know, let me let me just tell you this much. If you're a follower, you're gonna you gonna realize real soon you're a follower because you're gonna be around a lot of weak ass individuals feeling sorry for themselves, talking talking fake, talking cheap, ain't nobody discussing no business plans. Everybody's on some bitch shit. Everybody's on some trying to be a woman, trying to be a bitch. <laughs> There's so many dudes out here that think they woman is it's ridiculous. They think that it's it's ridiculous. There's so many women, women, and men's bodies out here. You'll be fucking surprised. You'd be fucking surprised. It, it it's really disgusting. It's that's why there's gender uh, identity crisis. All around the motherfucking board. Motherfuckers identifying themselves as 12-year-old girls. Because they never learned how to be a fucking man. A whole individual. A fulfilled, satisfied individual. I literally had a motherfucker told me, hey man. I, I, this, this nigga was down there 30 years old. Said he never made a girl squirt before. This this nigga said, I I I bet I, I hey man, I bet you I bet you make women you look like you can beat the shit out of the pussy. That shit made me laugh so motherfucking hard. You can sense that shit. You can sense when a nigga's on that big cat shit. I looked at that little scrawny ass motherfucker and I thought, yeah, I believe every word you say. I believe every word you say. You look like you ain't never even been able to penetrate a hoe longer than two minutes. That tic-tac dick out of here. Motherfucker's really afraid to, to level up. Motherfucker's really afraid to level up. They get they get caught in that codependent, toxic ass comfort zone. They don't want to grow. They don't want to mature. They don't want to expand, and they get stuck, stagnant, in a disease ridden mind. Yo yo your mind your your mental condition is just all out of whack. But you think you're doing somebody a favor, being nice, being nice. You ain't doing not a motherfucking person a favor. You're not doing a, not a motherfucking person a favor. People's laughing at you being nice. They say, "Hey, look, we can use this. We can use this guy. We can we can use and abuse this guy. He's always gonna be depressed and sad and at the bottom of the barrel because he's never gonna be mad enough to grab his nuts and and, and stand on his own beliefs. He'll he'll never he'll never talk back to his old lady. Women just look at you and lick your chops. He'll never talk back to us. He's a little bitch to us." He's a little bitch. We're not going to give him no pussy, but as soon as he gets money, we're going to go take his money. We're going to use him for all the energy he has. He's just another empty vessel to us. That's how women is looking at you. You showing up being all that, all that nice bullshit. It ain't working. It ain't working, buddy. It ain't working. You ain't going to get no gushy gush. You ain't going to get no respect. Ho hoes ain't finna bow down. Hoes ain't finna kiss your dick or your balls. They ain't finna do none of that. Cause you timid. You timid. Oh, can I please have a have a crumb of some pussy? Can I get your get your motherfucking timid begging ass out of here? Ho hoes can sense the bitch in you. They can they can sense the bitch in you. Make sure, make sure, make sure you cover that bitch sin up with some cologne. They can sense the bitch in you. If you got some money, they gon they gon sure they gon sure give you a little five ten minute little old weak ass fuck, weak ass fuck. As soon as you bust your nut, they disgust it. They done with you. As long as you breaking bread with you, as long as you breaking bread with them, they gon take that little old money and go fuck a big dick nigga like me and give me everything they got. Give me everything they got. They 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 willing to give me their whole motherfucking life. Cause they love a alpha big dick ass big cat. Hoes love it. They love it. Mwah, mwah. They eat it up. So you know what I'm saying? I'ma just leave you. I'ma just leave you. I'ma just leave you little kittens with a little old message from the big cat. Don't be no fucking bitch. That's all I gotta say. Hey, may the most high God bless you and, and, and transform you. And, and, and may you see the way of divinity and not being a bitch no more. Much love.